Today we are in Inverness and we're gonna eat at Coach's Pub behind us. We have been here a few times. We like it a lot. It's got some good food. I will say on the weekends it does stay open later. I want to say till what? One possibly? Yeah. So it can get a little loud in there. But we're just here in the evening and going to go show you what it's like. They do have really good wings, so I'm probably getting wings tonight. Okay. Let's go check it out. It's kind of funny because we just got a comment that somebody asked if we would do a tour of downtown Inverness. This isn't going to be a tour of downtown Inverness yet, but we do have it on our list of things to do. But you can see this is kind of the start of the downtown right here. They do have this nice mural up on the wall. And then right here on the corner is Coach's Pub and Eatery that we're going to go in. It's got soup, salads, char-grilled steaks, burgers, nachos, wings. Let's go see if we can get some hours. Right now there's quite a bit of parking, but we've come down here where all of this is filled and you just kind of have to maybe park like on over there's public parking and just walk a little bit. Um, but here is the building and let's see if we see the hours on the door anywhere. Might be on the menu inside. Yeah, I don't see them on the door. Let's head on in and see what it looks like. I know it is a seat yourself. So when you walk in, this is what it looks like on the inside. You can see in there's like the pool tables and stuff. And we're going to head over this way and sit right here. You can see how the walls are all decorated. That's really cool. And then right on down there is the bar and around the corner are the restrooms. And like I showed coming in, there's a room in here that has a bar and like some pool tables. But you can see all the decorations on the wall and all the TVs in here. There's a ton of TVs. They said today's specials are this. I have had a Sloppy Joe here before and it's very good. And then here's the menu. I forgot about the fried green beans. Those are excellent. We're gonna have to get those. Yes, like the, what is it, honey mustard? Yeah, so good. But here's the appetizers. Here's the burgers. Here's the wings that I was talking about. So they've got really good sauces. The Chipotle barbecue is what I get. And we got Chipotle barbecue wings at the Cove in Inverness, which I'll put that video at the end of this video. And they're like the same sauce and they're both very, very good. Here's some sandwiches. I think I've gotten the Reuben here. I don't remember though. I can't remember if I've gotten the Reuben or not. And then if we look at the other side, here's what the other side has, the big show. We've got some soup and salads. You've gotten a salad here that's really good, right? Isn't it the mango chicken salad or something like that? I think so. I think the mango chicken salad, or my mom maybe has. Mom yeah, has. and it was really good. Oh, I got the um, Caribbean chicken salad. Oh, the that Caribbean chicken salad? And we have tried their nachos. I think my dad got the nachos one time and they're good. And then carrot cake is amazing as well. And then here's their drinks. I currently don't see anything that shows gluten-free options, but like I said, I'm going to for sure get the wings, probably just the 10 wings maybe, with the uh, chipotle barbecue sauce, get some fried green beans. Do you know what you're getting at? It's such a big menu. At one point, they did have like grilled cheese for lunch special. We're not here at lunch, we're here in the evening, but they had like grilled cheese and chili and their chili is very good and their sloppy joe is very good as well i switched it up today and just got the lemonade i have gotten the arnold palmer here before but i was just filling some lemonade today you decided you want some wings too because they're so good and their ranch is good i think they use the is it the kins maybe i think so okay. and you're gonna do teriyaki probably okay so now we're gonna do the 20 wing. we're gonna share the 20 wings half teriyaki half um chipotle barbecue and then also the honey mustard wing. you may like that that'd be I'm really good stick with teriyaki because i know it's good that's your go-to usually yeah and then the fried green beans this would be interesting just trying the ranch for a wet sauce the music's a little loud in here so sorry if it's hard to hear but um like i said it's really cool there's monday specials up on the tv i'm not sure the hours we may have to look it up on the facebook page they're open monday 11 to 2 a.m Tuesday 11 to 12, Wednesday 11 to 12, Thursday 11 to 12, 
Friday 11 to 11, Saturday 11 to 3, and Sunday 11 to 12. So they do have some late hours. Here's the lemonade. I, it's good lemonade. I think it's just like Minute Maid lemonade or whatever, but that took what? Three minutes max? Yeah, not long. Here are the fried green beans, and this is the sauce, the honey mustard sauce that is just very, very good. It's better than the ranch with these, it's like a in little my opinion. Bit spicy. Not, yeah. not too bad, but it has some spice. Yes, and these usually come out very warm, so be careful before you just dig right in. Still good? Or is it a different? I think it's different. They switched it on us? I feel like it was like, cre like it has a, a creamier, creamier taste yeah. To it. Huh. You have to try it. Is it still good though? That's gonna stink if they switched it. It does seem like a different consistency though. Yeah? But. It's still good. Still very good. The fried green beans are just like top notch. But yeah, the, I think it's not as creamy or something as before. However, I would still recommend them. They're very good. And you can see there's quite a bit of them. So like a table of four, if you don't want to stuff yourself, it's, it's plenty to share. And then this is what the middle of the green beans look like. Yeah, I'm not sure what this reminds me of. I mean, it's not quite like the honey mustard was. I don't remember there ever being like little it's anything like in there. It's like or like citrusy or something. Mm -hmm. like so, it has a more of a fruit flavor. Yes. Still good, but the old one was more of just like honey mustard. The best way I could describe it is it's like the sauce you would dip coconut shrimp in. We've almost finished them. We're getting pretty full and the meal hasn't even come out yet. Now we've ordered the 20 wings before and there's no way we can eat them all. There's, there are a lot of wings. I definitely won't be able to eat all mine. Yeah, we'll just see what we can do. Here are the Chipotle barbecue wings. Very good, you can see there's a lot of them. And then here are the teriyaki wings. Oh yeah, they smell good. Mm -hmm. And now they only bring one ranch and it is Ken's ranch. And we asked for another one. You're preparing? <laughs> Good idea. Now, I will make note that I believe they do charge for an extra ranch. Also, comment below which style wings you like better. That style? The flats. The flats or the, the drums. drums. I prefer the drums because I don't get as messy eating those as I do those. But you prefer the one that you're eating, right? The flats? I'm not messy at all. You're not? No, yeah, it's crazy. I'm, I've got it all over me. So you took a bite, what'd you think? Oops. Very good? Yep. All right, I'm gonna give mine a try. Some ranch on there. Whoa. They're Very warm. warm. Yep. Not like hot flavor, just hot from the oven. Very good, I like them a lot. You can see, I mean, these wings are big. What, I've already done three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there are 10 very large wings. How you doing over there? One, two, three, you got six left, I guess? Look, only these two fingers still. Oh, oops. Good news is I've only got one hand that's all messy. The other hand is not. Normally I'm all messy, <laughs> all over the place. I think we're gonna call it, it's a lot of food. They don't really do good when you take them home either. They're not very good warmed up, but they do give you plenty of moist salads to wipe your fingers off and a whole roll of paper towels, so that's good. All right, I got all cleaned up here, and you can see total is $44.91, and they do charge 30 cents for an extra ranch. The wings are a little pricey here, um, but it's, it's very good and very large wings. Heading back outside. There is some outdoor seating spots as well, and there's a TV over in that corner that you can watch. And then I know there's an exit Right down there as well. That was our trip down to Inverness to eat at Coach's Pub and Eatery right behind us on the corner there. I am stuffed. I ate way too much. I'm comfortable because I know when to stop. You, I could have kept going and finished my other two, but I would have just, no, it wouldn't have been good. I really wanted the carrot cake because we've gotten it before. Mm -hmm. Very good carrot cake. Very good. I do want to say um, we had Jay as a waiter. We've had Jay before. Yeah, he's great. Awesome. Um, what else? There was something else I was going to say. So the sauce was different for the green yes. beans, but it was still good. So recommend those. The wings were good. How's teriyaki sauce good? Yep. Good teriyaki sauce. And then they do have like in the side that we were not seated in, they have pool tables uh -huh. and stuff like that. I think there's another bar in there too. Um, yeah. 
but usually when it gets later in the evening, that's the side that fills up and kind of becomes a little bit loud. Yeah, um, it can be. And then outside, out in front, I showed it a little bit, but there is outdoor seating and there's a TV out there as well. I think there's two TVs, maybe. Two TVs? Uh, yeah. Plenty of TVs if you want to yeah. watch a sports game or whatever. And each day, maybe just Monday through Friday, they have a special. Yeah. They may or may not show it on their website. I don't remember. I can't remember if they show it on their website Maybe or not. Maybe on Facebook. Maybe on Facebook. So check those out. Um, and like I mentioned before, we will be doing a tour of downtown Inverness. We're trying to catch some of the smaller towns, do a few tours of those. We just did Crystal River. So stay tuned for that. So with that being said, that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.